What? 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 Oh, God. oh shit, is Emily hanging? Oh my God, man. Yes, Emily is hanging. Oh, oh, shit. I'm sorry, I'm still in shock as to what we've just seen. Hey guys, it's Shavester here. And Cranky Kaz. We're back with Until Dawn. In the last episode, we lost Matt in a rather gruesome way, which was lovely. Uh, and everyone else seems to be in a bit of a shit situation as well. So should Yay. we pick up where we left off? <laughs> Let's do that. With the caveat that Squish 2 is not sleeping very well, so... We may have a bit of a bitty recording session. Oh, this is weird. Hey! Guys, come on! Hello? Sam? Do you think that was just a oh, clown? Oh, I think he did it rather than a scarecrow. The choice is yours. Quite possibly. Hello. Oh my god, we need help, please! Dear, no idea what's happened to Emily. She fell, but... She fell, but we didn't see a death. No. And we don't know what happened to Chris and Ash. Because we didn't actually sh choose to shoot either of them. Yeah, so what's gonna happen now? Yeah, what that's... the hell got him? It was, well, it was somebody. Wasn't it? And that was the last we saw of Mike. He's lost a couple of fingers. Yes, that wasn't great. But I got a trophy for that. So chapter seven, violence. Four hours until dawn. Well, we're getting closer. Damn. Damn. Oh yeah, Mike's gonna rescue oh, Sam. Thank you. What? I'm getting over it. Okay. But Jimmy, that was a bit of a mistake, wasn't it? Giving her a swivelly wheelie chair thing. Yeah. With a handy open grate. Yep. Oh, and a backpack's there as well. Even better. Very convenient. She's been through all of this and not broken a toenail. No, but she has got a fine. big scuff on her knee by the looks of it. Thank God you found me. It's okay. It's okay. You're okay? Uh. How'd you get down there? Let's just ask that. I, I don't understand. How did you get here? How'd you find me? Just a fucking maniac up here on the mountain. Yeah, I've noticed. He lives in this, like, web of tunnels. I was down there trying to get out, and then I found this crate, and I saw you. Listen. This guy who you're talking about, he attacked me. He showed me these videos too. And one of them showed Josh being killed. Just ripped apart by this huge fucking saw blade. Jesus Christ. What the fuck is going on around here? There's a door here. It won't open. Can you unlock it from your side? Like, let's good, let's, let's like actually do something That'd rather good, than chatting about this because I was is worried the psycho. Else in here? Worried the psycho was gonna like Oh, there come is in. stuff in here, yes. Well, can I, um, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Just give him a, <laughs> give him the finger. True found video camera, yeah. Later, fucker. <laughs> I'm out of here. Yeah. I'm still dressed in my towel, so. <sighs> and not that door. Just in case there was anything else around here. Yeah, I would not want to be her, like, with a towel. And that be all I'm wearing. Also, I'm amazed oh. she's getting the towel to stay up. Yeah. Okay, there's two doors. I think Mike is to the left. Uh, yeah, but do we want to go in the one that we think it's not? Well, it's not going to open anyway, so that's a... Uh... Good. Just in case it was like secret stuff, you know. Or the psycho. Yeah, it could be that as well, but whatever. <clears throat> He's still chatting He's away. He's chatting away to himself, Squish too. Hey. Jeez, you look like hell. Yeah. Nice to see you too. I think the jacket looks good on him. 
Well, at least he needed it because he didn't have anything else, did he? What are you doing? Well, actually, the towel didn't turn out to be the best outfit for fighting off killer maniacs, you know? Do you mind, Mike? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, turn around. My bad. Better get dressed. <laughs> Oi, so I'm trying to get, get a look. Oh, nice. We've got, like, sports attire. Yeah. Okay, done. Let's put this thing to bed. I'm into that. Oh, it's... Oh, shit, yeah. It's Ashley. <clears throat> oh, are we going to fight them? Oh, wrong them? stick. hanging oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm sorry I'm still in shock as to what we've just seen Damn it. But... <sighs> okay okay so this is how she survived for how much longer though this doesn't look too great for Emily that was a fucking quick, quick time, that was. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that could have been a very quick death. We've kept the flare though, haven't we? Yes, we have. Well, that was fortunate. I'm just thinking if we don't want to get nobbled by the thing that nobbled. Matt. Oh, shit, shit. Are, you, are you going to move? Please move. So she's now gonna hobble. No, no. Oh God! Here goes six hundred bucks. Better be worth it or the great in that top. Really? All right. Now we're talking. Oh, we got fire. Yeah, that's what we got. Fire. Fire is probably good. Now it's, I'm just thinking back to the whole saw thing now with Josh. I'm thinking like, what? <laughs> I can't even get the words out. I'm just still like, what, what the hell's going on? Okay, so there's a door there. So elevator to the surface or there's- I'm gonna have a look at this first because this looks like it's gonna be a case of looking through. There you go, okay. it's a mine cart. So she's walking okay now. Don't like these noises we're hearing. Nope. We're going deeper. This yeah, is I, don't, not... I don't like that. But apparently you're lifted around this way, so... True. Okay, so there is the lift. Let's have a look up here. Oh, well maybe we can blast through with that minecart we've just seen. Yeah, should we try and open this? Well maybe if we it, get in it. It's probably going to be a case of, right, it's locked, so we yeah. can't open it. It looks like it's locked. I yep. think we're going to have to blast <clears throat> it with that minecart. Yep. Dear, dear, dear.
Yeah, so what are you, what are you thinking right now? I'm thinking, what the hell? <laughs> to be quite frank, I don't know what to think now, because if that psycho is Josh, then what the hell is he wanting here? I mean, ooh, minor photo, okay. I mean, was he the one... Did he want to off his sisters for some reason? And now he's wanted to off his his mates for some reason? I, I, I just don't know. It's all very, very strange. But maybe I'm jumping to the wrong conclusions. I, I really don't know. Move a bit quicker, would you? So how do you explain the whole we see Josh killed and then yeah I know it did make me think like the whole I mean he's, he's screaming for a bit was seemed realistic but like the whole like sort of when it was supposedly cutting him open the sort of reaction on his face looked a bit weird if you ask me I don't know why it just didn't look like the sort of reaction of someone who's having that done to him, if that makes sense. Yeah, I don't know. You know what, I'm actually going to stop doing that. I'm going to uh, check out around here first. There's more shit. <laughs> Clocking in machine. I don't like the fact there's like a big dark area over there. Mm. But we have got fire, so. Oh, it's a ladder. Okay. Have we got options for where to go now? I don't know. I mean, there's this thing over here which looked like it would open something. Oh. I was there thinking, oh, that looks quite significant, so I'm going to do other stuff first. But let's have a look. <clears throat> No, so we're gonna have to use okay. that ladder. How do I get this thing on? Back to the ladder then. Yep. Sorry, just getting notifications from the cameras. Just checking to make sure there's nothing here going on, it's just the alarm. Fuck. <laughs> like disconnecting and reconnecting. Is he still alright? Yeah, seems to be. Good. I'm trying to work out whether he's falling asleep watching uh, Poker Melon. <laughs> Bless him. <laughs> Just FYI, we don't like make a habit of putting our kid in his bedroom with an iPhone. <laughs> oh! Fucking hell. No! Oh! Oh! Quick time. Oh, wait, no. Oh no. Oh no. You know the thing that shocked me more was your reaction to it? <laughs> uh, skulls. Is that wonderful? That's more skulls than just Oh my god, how many skulls? Uh, yeah, well these, I wonder if it's like anything to do with miners as well. Miners that didn't make it out for whatever reason. Could be. I do not want... like these noises. I want our flamey torch back. Uh, Matt, I'm afraid is... That is not Matt. Yeah, I wonder if she's going to find him. Oh god. Horrendous. Aren't we in like a different area though? Yeah, we're we're really, really low down. He was further up, wasn't he? Okay, so a knackered looking ladder. Yeah, as I was saying, we don't tend to make a habit of letting Squish Two like sit with an iPhone yeah. watching Kokomelon really to go to weird. bed, but he's not been sleeping anyway. What is that? It looks like a hard hat of some description. A miner's helmet. Me. Yeah. 
But he's been sleeping really badly, so... Oh! Hmm. Dearest Billy, Hurry home, home safely. safely from your loving wife and daughter, Agnes and Louise. Oh. Thank you, the Coastal Ripper, for the uh, tip to switch on the the text on the side. That's really helpful. Yeah, it's very helpful. Thank you. I hadn't realised that you'd switched that on for me. I did. Ah. Oh, just looked about. I need to look about. Yeah, Squish 2 has been sleeping so badly. We've been trying to get him down for about two hours tonight. <laughs> that does not go well. Do we have to climb? Looks like it. Okay. Good. To climb. Oh shit. Hobbs did it right. <clears throat> I'd be so fucked if I got stuck down there. I yeah, wouldn't be able I'd, to do that. I sort wouldn't of thing. have a clue. I wouldn't know. I would definitely struggle. And I would definitely fall and hurt myself. Right, okay. How yeah. long before we come face to face with the I don't know. With someone. If I was in a horror game or horror film, I'd be like the one that dies first. <laughs> I don't know, I think you and I'd be competing for that. <laughs> <laughs> for that honour. What is with all the noises? What are making those noises? <laughs> Sorry, Matt's not coming back. Unless he's in on it as well, and actually he's not dead. I mean, that was a pretty convincing meat hook to the mouth, wasn't it? it? it so... Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, like, if Josh is, has somehow faked his own death... Come on, for fuck's sake! Oh, oh no. no, battery's gone. Shite. Um, that, because I did think it was a bit weird, like basically he ran out after the whole spirit board thing and the next thing we saw was him tied up. It's like, how did he get there? Mm -hmm. But yeah, now that might make a bit more sense. Oh. Yes, let's have that, please. I'll have that back. Oh, we're back here again. Oh, I suppose you. Oh, the, oh yes, because it was. Yeah, because we how, fell, didn't we? We didn't get up the ladder, did we? So. Oh my god, finally something worked. Wonderful. What's going to happen when we go down here, though? I. I don't really want to find out. But I mean, I do want to find out, but at the same time, I don't. And as I was saying to you before, you know, we started this, I mean, like, this game is, like, disturbing me, like, big time. Um, but I want to keep playing it. I want to find out what happens, even if I end up sort of, like, losing most of the characters. And I want to do a second playthrough. Yeah. To see if any more, like, if we can get any more to survive. Oh, shit. What's this going to be? Oh, what the hell? Dangerous, Hotem. Was that Mike? I don't know, should we have a look? Also, what is that camera angle? That's not fair. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Guidance one is like the last one on that whole totem pole, mm. that is. Oh. Yeah, I don't like the camera angles either, but you know, it's all obviously all done deliberately to make you really uncomfortable. Something through there. What's that? Is it going to get us to look really closely and then something's going to jump out at us? No, we can't get to it. I think it's, it, you can see it shining through there, but you can't get to it yet. Hmm. 
I think. That's what it looks like to me. Might be completely wrong. I'm just thinking about the totems though. Yeah. Like because there's different paths you can take. Yeah. Is it even possible to get all of the totems in one playthrough? Or does it depend on what what path you end up on as to which totems you get? Or do Maybe. the totems move so you could get all of them? No, you wouldn't get all of them, would you? Possibly yeah, I don't because know. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, have we escaped? Thank fuck for that. Well, I don't know about that. Oh. I was going to say, that was very uh, optimistic to think you'd just be able to climb up there. Oh, no. Yeah, it doesn't bode well, does it? Going to have to go around this bit. Where's that barrel from before? We can go left or right. Oh, shiny. Swing over there. Pleased with yourself, by the way. Yes, very. So, someone knows that Beth's died. Well, like, if the psycho is actually Josh, that means whoever was chasing Hannah and Beth at the beginning might well have been Josh. But why would there be a cross? I don't know. Someone's found the body and. There's the thing on that, um. On that barrel, by the way. Hmm. Oh. Oh, she was down here. And the locket. We can't let Emily die now because she's discovered some good info there. She has. Do I want to go this way first? Is there any other way you can go? Towards the camera. Oh, okay. Oh! Look at that. Hello. Fucking hell. <gasps> That's head. Lovely. I'm gonna run back and have a look at this. <laughs> so we're gonna go back there. We're gonna go back there, yeah. <clears throat> yes. The fact that it's there. So is... that's just been <clears throat> left there? It has. So it hasn't been buried, but there's a cross for Beth. What yep. the hell? I don't know. Well, the thing is, a psycho chasing them at the time. Um, might have gone down and recovered their bodies. And then... I don't know. But is that person that we saw at the beginning the same person as the Psycho? What do you think? Potentially. Is that our way out? Are we back here again? It's another floor, probably. Is it? Looks very similar to the last one. Oh no, actually no, you're right, we are back here. Oh yes, so now we get to use that lift that was here. Oh, because the lights are on, because ah. it's working now. Okay. So I've forgotten we haven't, we've basically just taken a very long-winded route to get back here, haven't we? There we go. 
Okay. Are we finally safe? No, but she's gonna find she's gonna find Matt's body, isn't she? Do you think she is? Oh! Fucking... Yeah, we've got a flare still, remember. there for a second I think Squish 2 is out of his bed. Cliffhanger time. Cliffhanger. Are you sleeping? No. <laughs> well I can see that. No, don't. There's lots of lights on but are we going to go to sleep? No. Let's go for another drive with daddy. No. Right we're back. What's about to happen to Emily? Should we find out? She's hidden hasn't she? She's hidden and the guy's about to find her I think. <sighs> Cliffhanger. Ah. Oh. Josh. <laughs> Josh. <laughs> Josh. Oh, oh, very good. <laughs> Every one of you, you got my name. <laughs> and after all you've been through, good. Good, 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 good. I mean, how does that feel? Right? How does it feel? Do you enjoy feeling terrorized, humiliated? I mean, panicked? Guy's got all a those screw loose. That he my has. sisters got to feel once, one year ago. Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No, 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 no. They're gone. I don't know if you noticed this, Josh, but none of us are laughing. Oh, come, 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 come. Why the long faces? Come on. It's good to get the heart racing every now and then, right? And race they did. I mean, every one of you just pitter pat, pitter pat. I hope you appreciated my little phantasmagorical spectacle. I mean, <laughs> no detail too small. That just no happened. opportunity missed. It was such. A delight to play the puppet master to, to all of your Pavlovian panic. <laughs> and all that gore, 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 lore, fake bodies. Yeah. God, that shit was I was just expensive. talking to you about this and just no, now, wasn't I? No, no, no only I think that must have been how he did it. Yeah, how he did yeah, it. Yeah, off camera, Sherbs actually said to me, I've just had a thought about stinker. Josh. Josh but that's how he did it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Don't even ask this. And I was like, maybe. <laughs> yeah, you knew that obviously because uh, you you know the game, don't you? Definitely off his meds. Oh come on, you guys! Revenge is the best medicine. You're done, Mike. He's sick. What? Come on, you guys are all gonna thank me when you guys become internet sensations. Wait, what? What? Oh, you better believe this little puppy's going viral, ladies and germs. I mean, we got the unrequited love. We got. We got blood. I don't think there's enough hard drives in China to, to count all the views we're gonna get, you guys. What are you talking about, you asshat? Jessica's fucking dead. What? <laughs> Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. You are gonna fucking pay, bitch! Oof. Ah! Guys! Guys, come on. Seriously, this is crazy, you know? Shut up. Why'd you hit her, man? Huh? Why'd you have to fucking hit her? Uh, Oof. What are you talking you about? You punched Ashley, you piece of shit. Mm. Oh. I got so mad. You don't hit a girl. You, you just don't. Dude, dude, Chris, bro. I, and I'm not your bro. Where are we going? Where are you guys taking me? Locking you up, bro. What? You can't do anything stupid before we call the police in the morning. Come on. 
didn't do anything. Are, are you serious? So maybe there's someone else. Damn murderers, which you are. I didn't do it. Michael, please just listen to me, man. I did not hurt Jessica. I'm not going to be completely. You know what, man? You need to shut up. Chris, hey, come on, Coach. He's, we're partners. Stop. Don't say that. Oh, fine. Be a dick. Take a joke. Oh, oh wait. Did I hurt you? Did you just you feel a little a little bit of pain? Mm. Right now, I am so, so sorry! Ah! Stop it! Jesus, dude. Stop! Michael! I'm sorry, man. I can't tell you how sorry I am that something happened to Jessica, but I swear. I swear to you, I have no idea what happened to her. Ugh, which way do we go? Shut the fuck up or we can't trust her. Can't trust her, trust you. I think I'm going to go down the, the the sort of shut up route, just from the point of view of like, maybe he's got a point, maybe there, because I'm thinking there might be another person involved here. Then why would being aggressive get any more information about that? Well maybe, but at the same time we can't trust you, I don't know. But, well I suppose at the same time that's making the point of like, okay, we can't trust you based on everything that's happened. Aggressive shut the fuck up isn't going to get any help from Josh. No, true. This is, that's a good point. That's a different way of looking at it. Okay, fine. I'm going to go with that. Josh, to be honest, do you, do you really expect us to trust you for a single goddamn second after all the shit you put us through? <laughs> but can't we all just get along? <laughs> He's gone a bit nuts though, hasn't he? Damn it! <laughs> Not Dicking around. Well, it sounds like after Hannah and Beth's disappearance, You're just a bunch of bullies. he's not being too well. Hmm. Out a, a guy just to try like this, guys. Huh? Not like, not like you got the guts to really do anything about it, anyways. Ah! Ah! I'm gonna go with a defensive option now. Oh, stop it. You're the biggest coward there is. Uh-huh. I did something. I made you believe in the world I created. And I showed you parts of yourself you were too afraid to visit. You manipulated us. You tricked us, you hurt your friends, and you did it all while you hid in the shadows. You're a coward, Josh. That's all you are. Up if they just wiggle around. <laughs> leave me a little wiggle room. Huh? What does it take to shut you up? Oh, not so tight. I mean, he's clearly not well, is yeah, he? Yeah, he's 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 meds. cracked a bit, hasn't he? In God's name, is he talking about? This is hard to watch. You ever see this kind of shit before? Oh, I've never seen him like this. Money back. <laughs> Oh, I don't. Said you're a dummy, dummy. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Oh, Ashley. Oh. Ashley, I'll get you out of this. I won't let you die. Oh, I never imagined in my wildest dreams that you liked me. Stop. <laughs> you know what that sound is? It's the sound of never kissing Ashley, you pussy. Stop. Yeah. You know, you might as well let Ashley sleep with Mike. I mean, at least he's got some notches in his belt, you know? He'll treat her right! You're fucking pathetic, Christopher! I'm gonna beat his head off! Don't listen to him! It's not, not worth it. It, it is it? not worth it. Hey, Mike. He's not well. Mike, 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 Mike. Mike! What? What happened with Jess, Mike? 
You know what happened. No. No, I... I don't. I got a problem, Mike. I don't remember killing Tess. Christ. No, I mean, like, I feel like I, I would remember killing her, you know? She's so soft. And she's probably got, like, a really tight bod. Shut your fucking mouth! Uh, disarm Mike. Yeah. Disarm. Let's go! Yeah. Seriously? Yeah, I mean. What? Did you think I was gonna shoot him? I, just in oh, case. Come yeah. Come on, Chris. You know me better than that. Yeah, Chris. You know me better than that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, just next time, give me a heads up. All right. <gasps> oh, you poor little piggy. Okay, now you can hit Josh. Yeah. Cup bed, cup routine to work. Leave it to the pros, bros. Why don't you go back to the lodge? Make sure everything's all right. I'll stay here with this lunatic until morning. Oh, sleep over. <laughs> hey, can we order pizza? <laughs> you sure you're okay? I did not yeah. expect this to be the way this went, but okay. Yeah, you're right. The thing is, though... See you in the morning. We're not out of the woods yet, are we? No. Because... There's someone else. Because... So, yeah. Josh doesn't know who's killed Jessica. No. Nope. And I believe him. Yeah. Josh. I believe him too. <laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! Nope! No, no, no! They're what would gone. happen though if Jess had survived? Jessica's fucking dead! What? Did you uh -huh. hear me? Jessica is dead. We're gonna fucking pay you, Jess! This all would have gone differently if Jess had Jess survived. Yeah. I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. I really want to do a playthrough where oh, she survives now. Yeah. Oh my god, Matt! Are we coming back to this bit now? Potentially. I really hope hiding was the right thing. Yeah. Oh, we're about to find out. Chapter 8, Revelation. Only three hours till dawn now. Don't do it! Oh. oh wow, is he on our side? What the fuck, Emily? Oof. So he's on us. So he's actually wanted to help us. I hope we still have that flare. What was that? He's just throwing. I have down. no idea. We'll have to find out. Yeah. Oh my god. All right, All right, let's go. Oh, okay, so we got given flares by him anyway. Looks like it. Maybe that's another way to get it. If you hide and he finds you, if we'd run and not had one. Mm-hmm. And if we didn't have the flare from earlier. Yeah, but the, the flare from earlier, he's, he's still got, she's still got. Um, and that might be a defence mechanism in case, like, the psycho comes yes, to Yes, I go. know, but I mean, if she hadn't taken the flare earlier and she'd run from that guy, mm. she might have died in the mines. I feel like we're going to have an encounter, but we're going to be okay. Maybe. This area of the mine has recently suffered structural collapse. Please contact Foreman. Great. Good. One of the danger points. Yep. Oh, no. Uh, actually, I didn't want to drop down. Never mind. I think that was only our only option, wasn't it? It was, but there was actually another area that I hadn't actually gone into. Oh. But never mind. Too late now. Oh, I kind of wish we hadn't dropped down here. Oh, well. Never mind. It is what it is. And, of course, the flare that she had from the radio tower is one of the ones that you shoot up shoot into up. the air. Yeah. That's more like to get help rather than... Yeah. With a totem? It looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah, it is a totem. Don't like how close those are sounding, those noises. Yeah, I know what you mean. Okay. Fortune totem. The mic has a gun. Uh, 
but that's like if he doesn't shoot something badly, so it doesn't go after something. Oh, I don't know. Oh, there's like a, the events of the past, and then you can press play in that menu. Did you see that? Uh, I didn't. Let's have a look. Play the events of the past. What's that? Sometime after the prospect. Oh, so this you unlock. I'm guessing you unlock this stuff with every totally Until fine. This is going to be like a whole movie and of things. Mad murderers. That's my guess, anyway. Eating human flesh. And many hunts. Until one night, a year ago. I was finally able to get him in. We were not alone in the woods that night. No. Okay. I couldn't save your Interesting. Okay. Huh. Yeah, as you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear, so it'll give us all the all the uh, story as we find all the rest of them. Right. Okay. That's what it looks like, anyway. Yeah. I don't remember seeing anyone no. play that little video on Let's Plays that I've watched no. in the past, no. Okay, so I feel safe so far, because we've got this. Don't go near those things. <sighs> Sure, it's fine, but okay. Oh, enter okay, gas. gonna be the way. Actually, can I go back? No, I can't. No, go back. we've ended oh. it. Oh god. Surface, go left. Four Sorry if you die because of that. It's not working, is it? Oh, it is working. Good. Flare's gone out. Oh god, it's chasing us. Shit, it's chasing Shit. us. <laughs> yes. Blow the bastard up. Am I smart? Yep. Oh, I don't think that's a good idea. Um. Um. Where yeah. even is that going? Get off it, get off it. At least we've got the option to stop now. Oh, it looks like we've just come up here, but never mind. Oh my Christ, shoot it in the head! <gasps> It really doesn't give you that much, much time. time to react to all that. Well done. I think that. Oh god. I was about to say, oh shit, it's still fucking there. Oh fuck. Oh god. I was like, you did good there. Ow. If she fucking dies now. You're not dead yet. Come on. We must be safe now. We did good. Sorry, what the fuck did you do? <laughs> you did good. <laughs> oh, 
all you did was try to fucking jump scare me. <laughs> I told you to go left. True, you did tell me to go left. Very, very true. And that wasn't because of something I remembered, that was because it seemed like a good idea. Still, but still... we're still being chased, we're not out of the woods yet. Or, or she's just trying to get out of there. So to speak. She's at the lodge. Crap, what now? No. I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Okay? You look totally wild. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out Did you there. Split up? A monster is in Wait. Mon Wait, a monster? Yeah. yeah. What are you talking about? I said there's something out like there. Like what? Gosh, relax, it was Josh. It was all Josh. No, 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 listen to we me. We got him tied up. He can't hurt you. No, it was after me and it wasn't human. Hold on. What happened? <laughs> M, can you tell us exactly what happened? I like that. Where's Matt? Don't give a shit about we were Matt. Coming up the tower and it, it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mine. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What mines? There are these mine shafts all over, running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell. How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines, and it was dark, and I found this pile, and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head. I found. Oh it. my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Listen, in in the tower there was there was a radio and I, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh God, yeah, yeah, Mike. Barely. What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. Emily, hey Em. Whoa. What the fuck can that be? I don't know, but we're going to pause there. Yeah, we're going to have to pause again because Squishy's coming to see us by the looks of it. So back in a minute. Here we go again. So what's this noise? It's not Jess. No, because Jess is dead. Yep. Who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. Good. Well, is that the guy that... Emily's just had a run in with. Okay. I'm gonna open the door. You ready? You ready? It's the same sort of thing. Whoever yeah. it is probably gone by now. I, I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. <laughs> I come on. Just fucking. Just open it. He's clearly there. Otherwise, he's gonna get nobbled. Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Oh, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Who are you? Uh, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? How oh, responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What is he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe You've got a not. scar across your eye. Yep. I kind of believe you. Well. <laughs> Get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. Yeah, Mike, be quiet there for now. is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Who's resorted to oh, cannibalism? Oh. You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? 
until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out there, Chris. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. Then I'll go with you. I, oh, I don't know. You. You're going alone. It's suicide. I'd much rather have this guy's help. Fine. The rest to be uh, I meant, oh no, that they're basement. going for Josh. Yeah, well, don't go outside this guy at least don't seems to know you. what to expect. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh... Yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. Sure, okay. So we've un unleashed some curse because of cannibalism. Oh. This is the end you point towards the thing you want to kill. Thanks. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. What? How do you know? The way you're holding it. Trust me. I know. <laughs> hey. Come back safe. Aww. Oh, we need to hurry, son. I, uh... See you soon. We need to make sure he lives now, don't we? <laughs> yeah, no pressure. Ah, shit. So, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. Uh, what's, uh... What, what's a guy gotta know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. All right, I can try to do that. So, how many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you'll be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, and it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it, and it can kill them if you have to. Their skin is like... It's like tough armor, unless you burn it off first. Hence the fact he's carrying a flamethrower, I guess. Well, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're going to do? I sort of want to go off the, off no, the path, but... No, don't. Like any animal. Yeah. Or human. Well, you mean like how? Like they've got schedules? Why? Well, oh. He's probably just nervous as fuck and asking like weird questions as a result. Why? I didn't ask. <laughs> yeah, I like that. <laughs> yeah. Bro, when to go to oh, Chris, just shut up, mate. Garlic all over me, they would smell me or something. They'll still smell you. Anything like that. I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. Sight is based on change. I didn't know toads couldn't see so if I don't, you move, I, don't move. I'm basically invisible. Did you know that? Yeah. Nope. Well, I wouldn't recommend testing it out. Unless you have no other choice. Right, well, here we are. Is Josh still gonna be alive? I don't know. Or is he gonna have been it's... nobbled? I don't know. But that door's locked. If these things Wendigos are or, or were human. Do they, do they still have some aspect? Oh, oh dear. Yeah. Damn it, what happened? No, oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. We gotta go. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He could still be out there. <laughs> Doesn't sound too good. That. Let's go to the lodge. Yeah. yeah. Let's go now. It might still be near. 
not a good time, sorry, for you to come along and... Uh, oh. Cat, no! Cat. Jesus Christ. <laughs> the cat's just gonna fuck this up. <gasps> Don't move, Zaya. <gasps> we moved! I did not move! Run! Fuck. I did not move, you assholes! Oh! God damn! Yep. Oh shit! Run, Go ahead. Chris! Run, Chris! Oh, oh shit! Oh shit! Woo! Sorry, sorry. Get moving, come on, man. Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> Shut the door. Oh dear. Whose body is that? It's dragging. That's Josh, isn't it? Josh is. Oh no. Oh my god, guys, thank god. It took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, God. All right. These are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until that's dawn. That's clearly yeah. not going to happen, though, is it? Down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. If that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. Em. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? So uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. Oh, Maggie, it's having his head cut off by the looks of it. Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? There had been a cave in, in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh, my God. Some of them survived, but, like, 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck out of here, please. <laughs> I'm just saying. Priorities. It's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. <sighs> Shit. Fuck, fuck. You guys know what to do. Do we? Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. So Mike leaves. Yeah, I'll obviously. Gotta play the hero. Oh. Yeah, looks like it. Uh, 
Is she okay? You're getting jealous of Sam for sitting next to Chris? I thought that that he was gonna help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've gotta be tough. We've gotta do this on our own. What are you slinking off to do? Well, she's academic, isn't she? Oh, she decided to read. So, journal cannibalism. Only a few men have dared to hunt the Wendigo. I'm the only this man who has... a little OCD. Oh. ...ever kept them under control. Heed these words, or it shall be your death, and your death will not be the last. The Wendigo must be contained. The Wendigo grows out of cannibalism. When a human is desperate and craves food, trapped on the mountain in the fierce winter storms, when he has eaten nothing for many days, the Wendigo spirit will begin to possess him. Even the strongest man is weak to it, he will kill without remorse, often those companions who have travelled with him. He will eat the flesh raw from the corpses. I have seen this happen many years ago, the craving for flesh that cannot be sated, and then the change begins. The eyes turn first and become milky and white, then the teeth become longer, like fangs. The creature grows and the skin is pulled taut across the bones. And more? Oh, so the mining... There was a tribe that lived in these mountains, the Cree. Their shamans tell stories of a tall creature There's born in ice. There's history to this. Um, the tribe respected the mountain and all the animals that lived on it. The mountain became sacred, sacred to the Cree. Every animal became sacred also. The Cree believed it was bad luck to harm an animal on the mountain and would hunt elsewhere. I'm glad we did not do anything to those deer now. <laughs> yeah. In 1893, the miners arrived. They found tin and later traces of radium. They mined deep into the sacred mountain. The Cree say that the mountain cried out and the spirit was released. Okay. Oh god, there's more. Combat! Good to know. The Wendigo's eyes change. They be both be they become both sharper and more dim. It says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. Great. Can I finish reading, please? Thank you. <laughs> the Wendigo sees movement. It's a hunter like a hawk, but it cannot see stillness. If you are to keep totally still, the Wendigo will not be able to see you. The skin and flesh of the Wendigo are hard like armour. They seem to feel no pain. They cannot be cut or stabbed. Bullets will not pierce their skin, though a shotgun will keep them at bay. So it knows how to hunt as it can mimic its prey. I've killed six Wendigos. Knives or bullets will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. Fire envelops them, burns away their skin, makes them weak, but try not to kill them. Killing a Wendigo should be the last resort. Death releases the Wendigo spirit into the air. I have contained them. I use traps to catch them and fire to drive them into cages. The traps were baited with human limbs from those who had no further use for them. One by one I caught those who had infested the mountain. He's been here for ages then. Looks like it, yeah. There may oh. be defences. Shamans wrote of rituals. I found native artefacts on the mountain and copied them. Totems. Oh, so he did the totems. All right. Bunches of herbs and feathers, I copied their designs, I've tested them. Out on the mountain they work, they keep the Wendigo at bay. Not entirely, but enough. But inside buildings they do not work. Cree legends say that the Wendigo grows from the bite of another Wendigo. But the bite is harmless. I've been bitten, but I did not change. The only way is to eat the flesh of another, there is no other way. Okay. Right. Uh... Oh no, 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 what? no, no. What is it? What does it say? Let me see that. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get to Mike. Like now. So we're all going to leave, aren't we? So much for staying safe. Listen to me. <laughs> because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. <laughs> Remember last year? Huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. This analyst guy. Self-centered fear. While a reef threat. This is Josh's internal monologue. No, it's all about you. Seems like it, yeah. It's always all about you. 
I think. That's how I interpret it. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your Making more sense though, isn't it? Sisters have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become? Huh? Kind of feel sorry for Josh now. Mm. Joshua, why did you hurt them? Technically, he didn't hurt anyone. No. Physically. Oh, but of course you did. They were your friends. You misled them. You lied yeah, to them. Yeah, the other way of looking at it is that way. Through a night of genuine horror. Let's hope. It's not too late for atonement. Oh, do you think there could be and atonement? Your friends, if they Maybe. Say all your friends can save you from this terrible isolation. Previously on Until Dawn, Mark Four. <laughs> oh my God, guys! Thank God. What took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. I wonder if we could have saved uh, yeah. that guy if I Wait. somehow managed to keep completely oh. still. Yeah, maybe. Alas, I tried to keep still, and then... It certainly made it more interesting. It did. Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. And what is all that? It may have taken him down to the mine. I was down there. It's horrible. There'd been a cave in, in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. <sighs> Shit. Fuck, fuck. You guys know what to do, okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. Okay. Chapter 9, Despair. Two hours until dawn. So we're getting there. Oh, yeah. Back in the sanatorium, but we're going to leave it there with that thing unlocked, and we'll see what happens. And we think it might end up being. So I think you told me there were ten chapters in this, right? Yeah. So the next episode might be our last. Yeah. Um, we're doing pretty well. I mean, we. Yeah, I feel nobody, like a lot better about things now. Nobody died that episode. <laughs> no, nope, apart from the guy. Apart from the guy who's not really flame through a guy. Flame yeah. through a guy. Rip flame through a guy. But <laughs> no main character died. Nope. Um, and uh, as you, as it turned out. We have one more character than we thought because Josh actually isn't dead. <laughs> yes. Yes. So I was there thinking, oh, we've lost three, but actually we've only lost two. But do we want to save him or not? That is the question. Yeah, well, <laughs> I we'll think see we've what happens. Done, yeah, we'll yeah. see what happens. We will see what happens. So, yeah, one more episode of this to go, guys. So uh, join us then. Bye. See ya.